Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today is about May 1st, and May 1st means something special around here. It means some of our earliest trails are actually open for mountain biking. The problem is I've been spending all my time working on the boys' bikes and not my own, and my bike is giving me all sorts of problems. So we're gonna fix and replace the bottom bracket and the cassette on my bike because the bike shop told me it needed it, and I would rather do it myself than have the bike shop do it. So. We're gonna get that changed out real quick and then we're gonna take you along for a ride up Stinking Springs, one of our favorite trails. Man, this is the life, guys. We're out on the Stinking Springs Trail today, opening day. And it's like, probably 60 degrees, 65 degrees, somewhere in there. It's a little windy, but the wind is kind of keeping it nice and cool. This is the nice thing about our first ride of the year, is we're not too far from the house. It gives us a chance to kind of get the bikes in, in shape. Huh. All right, champ, just slow and steady. Just take deep breaths. Re relax your breathing. Okay? We're in no hurry. This is just for the fun today. All right, we're going to follow Tyler for a second. So the first part of this trail is called Sidewinder. The second part is called Stinking Springs. And it really is just a five-mile, six-mile straight climb. And the climb's like... I can't remember if it's 1,500 feet, 2,000 feet, somewhere in there. It's a pretty brutal climb, but it's really good for fitness. And it's opening day, May 1st. But what's really sad is, considering the fact that we're still in spring, this trail is as dusty as it usually is in late summer. So I think this year's drought's gonna be pretty bad. Unless we get some moisture here soon. So one thing we're trying to teach the kids today is trail etiquette. So this is a up and back trail, so it's got two-way traffic. We tend to get a lot of people going downhill and we're going uphill. And so who has the right of way and how do we teach the kids to practice good etiquette? I gotta, I gotta breathe. Go oh, baby. So one way we do that is we tell the kids, the riders going uphill have the right of way. Agree or disagree, that's the general rule, is the riders going uphill have the right of way because it takes a lot of energy and effort to get off the bike and start the momentum, especially when you're climbing like this. So even though we have the right of way, we try to tell the kids it's cur courteous to just be on the brake and get over to the right as much as possible. You got Ryan right down here, and the parking lot we came from is way down there, and that's the South Fork of the Snake River there, and we're just about a mile and a half in. Took us about 20 minutes, but that's because Ryan's kind of just learning how to ride this trail. He's doing great. One thing I'm noticing as I get older, and my kids get older, is it's getting harder and harder to keep up with them. I got a 14-year-old up above. I'm trying to catch up to desperately. Tyler, with all his gymnastics, is staying in better shape than I thought he would. Andrew's laughing at me because I can't quite catch him. He's egging me on up there. But give you a quick glimpse. This trail cuts back across this ridge up here and then gets to that ridge up there and goes way back up to the top, if you guys can see way up there. So we're two miles in, there's like three or four to go. I caught up to Andrew, time to go up the ridge, hit the next set of climbs. This next little section is a little technical, so we're gonna see how good Andrew's improved over the winter. Oh crap, that line. Oh, come on, you stop right in the middle of the trail. All right, get this one, get all of it. Nice job. Dude, I'm impressed. You made easy work of that last section. We're seeing signs that 
winter is still around. Got some snow right here. Trail ahead of us. And we're back at the ATV trail. So Andrew and Tyler are going to keep on. They're going to follow this all the way up here. You can kind of see where the... If you can see right here, there's a dirt biker coming down. Or a couple of them. And that's where they're going to go. And I'm going to turn around and go back down and find Ryan. Hey, that right there. Whoa. <laughs> hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Hey, you made it a long ways. If we go up a little bit further, I think I think you guys have time to make it all the way to the top. You want to go all the way to the top with me? Um, well, not all the way to the top, but the top of this trail, not the top of the other trail. Um, the top of this trail. Sure. Only like a half a mile to a mile. It's like the. Isn't the top? Isn't the top? The top is where we turn around and come back downhill. We'll come back down this trail. Oh, okay. Sound good? Okay. One thing we really try to do with these kids when we start off with not biking is teach them how to get on and start from a stop on a hill. And that's kind of hard for most kids. So what we do is we teach them to get down here with their left foot uphill so that they've got nice, easy reach. And then their right foot, we get the pedal up as high as we can. And then what they do is they just kind of push off with the left and push down with the right. And it's a nice smooth start. So Ryan, go ahead, give it a shot. Go. One, two, three, go. Just like that. And if we can teach them how to do that, then they can have a better time. And it's more fun if they're not, <laughs> it's just frustrating to get them started. Okay, level paddles. Come to brace, nice and slow. There you go. Very good job. Now we're going to climb again. Push it, right? Try to control. Don't lock up those tires if you can help it, okay? Nice and easy around the turns. Right the outside, outside edge. Take every turn nice and wide. You know what that means? Go around the outside of the edge, not the inside corner, okay? You're doing excellent. Look out a little bit further ahead of you, okay? Don't look right in front of your tire, look out just a few feet. Keep your head up just a little bit more. Hey, it's a little rocky, just get stand up, stand up, stand up. Oh, no, don't, 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 don't do that. No, come back, you gotta ride that. Just roll over it nice and easy. There you go. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Find a good line. Perfect. Hey, you did that like a boss. Something wrong? We're gonna drop his seat post. Yeah. <laughs> is it tight? Yeah, it is. No. Oh. I don't think I can. It. It's getting in the way. Ah. Good to know. Okay. All right, dude. Show me some good stuff right here. Bend those knees.
Okay, right, Tyler, you gotta make a good pass. Go ahead and pass it. Tyler, you gotta go a little further. 